So guys, in today's uh, in today's video, I tell you who uh, the differences between a, a stance variable and class variable. What is with the difference between a stance variable and class variable? We use a stance variable when we have to associate any property with a particular object. A class variable and when we have to create a variable for the whole class. Okay, a, which we uh, which will be shared by, by all the stances. It's okay. I briefly explain in this video what I have just said. I okay. And let's move to the computer screen and let's get started. So like like me, I will be tell you in my intro. I will be telling you stands versus class uh, variables. Okay. So now let me tell you stand versus class variable. In Python, variable vari uh, variables can be defined at the class level or at the stands level. Okay. Understanding the difference. Different understanding of between these type of variable is variables is circular for writing efficient and main maintainable code. Okay, so class variables, class variables, class variables are defined at class level. They are shared among all stands of class. Uh, they are defined outside of any method and are usually used to store information that is common to all stands of the class for example a uh, class variable can be used to store the number of stands of class that have been created like here i will be write like class and here i will be write like my class and then here i will be write like class and then here i will be write like variable and variable and dash and zero okay and then i will be enter and here I will be write like def and here I will sorry first I will be space here and here I will be write like def def and then here I will be write like init then here I will be sorry here I will be write like self what we can write like self okay and then we will be write like that and here I will be enter press enter press again but yeah here here I will be write like my my class dot class and here I will be write like variable and then here I will be write like plus slash one and it is okay like my class dot class and slash variable and here I will be write like that and then I will be end the rest. so what we can do here we will copy and here I will be go and here I will be paste. And then what will we do? Here we will go and here we will be uh, enter press and enter press. Here you will be enter press. Here we will write like dev enter. Here we will write like print and the print shall be class uh, variable and here we will be write like self self and you will be right like that enter and then you will be again enter sorry and that and here you will be right like print my class my class dot class and here i will be right like variable like here we will be writing like that so we will be uh, do like that and okay and we will do like that and enter press again but here's giving the one Error, so I will be copy it and we will be paste it. And now, what you will be do? Enter press and then you will be do like, like, uh, mm, yeah. Here we will be going. Here we will be write like object one, object one slash my class, and then we will be write like that. And here we will be write like object two and object two slash my class and then we will be gone and then enter so here we can write like object object one dot print class and here i will write like variable where 
reable and then we will write like nothing and here we will be erased like that then you will be go down and this is the output is output of object one is two and then go down and here I will write like object two dot print class variable and that and what do will we do and this output is also a two okay and then then when we run it it given the error in line 14 what type of error it will give me? like object one dot print class variable Take both most recent call last file main dot pi line 14. Like I will be what you can do uh, copy and paste. Yeah, you will be like like that. You will be not give any space and you will be uh, write like that and and then we will be run. So it will give not this uh, not any the uh, thing and it is coming like two. Ooh, okay, so it is very easy. Like here when we will you will be write like three, so the here when you will be write like three, so the answer is come six. The answer is coming like six, and when uh, here is like uh, my class, and here I will be write like five, and then I will be run. So answer is the uh, five uh, eleven. Here will be here it is coming like that. Okay, for, uh, for, okay, so it is coming like that, and. Here it is coming like that. And when you will be do like one or one, so the output is come different like three. It is very easy. And now, when, uh, and now let me tell you how it has happened. In this example above, the class variable is shared among all stands of class. My, my class, when we create new stands of my class, the value of class variable is in incremented when we call the print class variable method on object 1 and object 2 we get the same value of class variable like have, have you will be seeing it so it is very easy okay and now uh, I, uh, I hope you will understand class variables I hope oh, and now when we will come to the instance variables instance variables are defined at the instance level uh, and are unique to each instance of the class. They are defined inside the init method and are usually used to store information that is specific to each instance of the class. For example, an instance variable can be used to store the name of an employee in a class that represents an employee. I hope you will be understand. So now, let I will be go here and erase it. Now, here I will first of all, now let me tell you what the stands. Let first of all, here I will be write like class and here I will write like my class. And here I will be write like def and init and here we will be write like self comma name comma age. No, yeah. No, here you will be not write like that and then comma name. Only that, and then you will be right like that, and in it and self comma name, and here we will be do like that. Uh, it is given there. It is it's simple. Okay, and now you will be go down here. We will be write like dot self dot name and slash name. Okay, so now you will be end the press, and here we will be write like dev print name and then you will be like self it is easy and then you will be like print and then you will be like self dot name and then what you will be do i will be what i will be do here i will be enter press and here i will be like object one slash object one slash my class here I will be do like John. Okay, you will be write like your own name, and here I will be write like object two 
hashtag sorry here we write like that and space from here space from here and here we write like my class and the name of the class is jane okay enter and here we can write like object one dot print name and then here we will write like output it is a comment output should be john and the object two dot print slash name and the hashtag output should be chain and now let me see you uh, the output that's come like hi uh, it is giving the error in uh, line 11 what type of error object one dot print name oh, hmm. like i will be here we will be go and pick and okay now when we will be run it so it is come like john and jane why john and jane come because here i will like john and jane it is a name if i here i will be right like ryan and here i will be right like ali and alisa also alisa i will right so when you run so here is come like ryan and alisa why because here it is a self and name here it is a name okay here when you be is and here is a color so it will giving the uh, and we will be go and it will uh, giving the error why because the, uh, because the here is come like name name and all 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 section with name but when you will be write like here color to it will giving the error and when you will be run it so it is coming right Ryan and Alisa and here is like the num number is come and same to here, here it is a variable you will be define a variable that's why the output is come like 2 it is very simple now in this example above each stand of the class my class h is all value for the same variable when we call the print name method and object one and object two we get different values for name it is very simple and summary in summary class variables are shared among all the stands of a class and are used to store information that is common to all stands stands variable are unique to each each stands of a class and are used to store information that is specific to each stand understanding a difference between class variable and stand variable is circular for writing inferentially and main, main, maintain maintainable code in python it uh, is also worth not, nothing that in python class variables are defined outside of any method and don't need to compare don't need to be explained declared as class variables they are defined in a class variable a class level and can be and can be and can be access vi class name dot variable name or self dot class dot variable slash name but stand variable are defined inside the inside the method and need to be explained declared as instance variable by using cell dot variable slash name so i hope you can enjoy this class i will tell you stands versus class variable stands variable versus class variables in python and so i hope you can enjoy this class enjoy like this video share your friend and subscribe to my channel and please access my python playlist also and like i will be telling you uh, i will be tell you here you will be go here and search code with pk and when you will be search so uh, open my channel and first of all subscribe it and all the notification bell and then see my popular videos like that and see my python's video like i will be uploading and to then go to the playlist and click the python tutorial for for 
a python tutorial uh, with projects and here we will see it please access this playlist and comment me and like and subscribe uh, my channel and access this playlist and bookmark it go here i will be already bookmark my playlist so you will be also bookmark it and save it so i will be meet you in next class and next very amazing class of python and now for today goodbye